Election day is less than two weeks away here in the U.S. Around the nation, early voting has started in states such as Arizona, Illinois, and Wisconsin. During the election season, commercials and other political ads often take up the TV screen times from coast to coast. For places such as Pennsylvania, which presents as a key state for the presidential election, the influx of commercials and other advertisements have led to early fatigue for voters in the state. I get very annoyed by it because people are going to vote for who they, who they think is the best person to vote for. For some around the swing state, they feel the ads aren't giving enough information on the candidate's policies. Always running somebody down. Tell yeah. me what you're going to do for me and my family and my country, not yeah. running the other person down and making them feel stupid. As election day continues to creep closer, people around northern Pennsylvania feel as though the advertising can become a bit overwhelming. It is overwhelming because then it turns into, okay, so there's pros and cons with this person and there's pros and cons with this person. It's turning out to where my, my generation doesn't want to vote. This year, it's expected that about 8 million young Americans will be eligible to vote for the first time, totaling up to around 41 million from Gen Z. For young voters coming up, redline topics can range from foreign affairs to the U.S. economy. All this politics happening because prices are up and down, up and down, don't know what's going on or who to do or who to go to or nothing. It's getting annoying. As early voting has already begun in Pennsylvania with over a million ballots turned in, many are ready to see election season come to an end so they can get back to regularly scheduled programming. Dante Brown, Big Fox News, Mansfield.